Hey, what's going on guys? Adam Brown Adventures here. Today's video is a little bit different. I actually wanted to talk about a really cool experience about a month or two ago when me and Jeremy were up in Indiana searching. We had a follower message us and tell us about how they were searching through Google Maps in the area and they believe they actually found a car in a little pond and we get so many messages from so many of y'all watching and I just it helps out so much you know we get tips leads on local cases we only have so little time when we're out traveling so it just really helps us use the best use of our time narrow down search areas and I just really wanted to make this video to kind of appreciate y'all watching sending us all the messages on all social media this was a really cool instance though for this video where someone one of my followers reached out and said that hey I think there's a car in this local pond can you guys go check it out I saw you're in the area so we're like yeah sure if you're searching for missing people you have to search everywhere nothing is out of the question she was able to find this on Google Maps and I looked at it you guys can look at the picture here that she sent and it does kind of look like there might be a car we went there and explored it and lo and behold it was a vehicle so I'm gonna go into the clip a little bit more than I did I, I showed a little bit of this footage on one of my previous videos but I really just wanted to make a video highlighting this because I just think it's fascinating and it's another way that y'all watching can help us search Google Maps look in little bodies of water you know if the water's not very clear it's probably gonna be a little bit harder but some water is clear enough where you can see, or shallow enough where you can see the tops of vehicles, strange shapes. And we're always open to go check out new areas and see what we can find. So I'm going to go up to the computer. We're going to go over this footage a little bit deeper. I just think it's so cool. And it's just another way that y'all can help us when we're searching. And, you know, send us messages. We really appreciate it. Me and Nug, you know, if you think you see something, send something. But let's look at this footage a little bit deeper. All right, so I'm about to fly my drone and just see if I can go look at this pond. We may need to get closer. But we will see. Actually, it's not that murky. What's this? Something back there's a tent? Oh, somebody's camping back there. Oh, there it is. Dude, what is it? You see it? Yeah. No. No way, that's a car. It's 100% a car. No, it's not. What kind of car is it? How do you say it's oh, not, dude? Oh, dude, it, it is. Yeah, it's 1,000% a car. That's a car. See this, the windows on the side and everything. Doesn't look like a black Mercedes, but... Oh, there's a ramp right there. Dude, it, yeah, it is a car. Just just walk back there. We'll be able to see it. What kind of car is it? You can see the side windows and everything. I mean, it kind of does. I don't think it's a Beamer, but we can go look. We'd, ha we'd have it's to not, go look. It's not our car. Nah. Unless it's all mossy and stuff, but that's definitely a car. There's I'm... no doubt that's, a, that's not a car. Let's walk back there and look. All right, so we're making our way over here to check out this car. Some people fishing with their kids, so. And somebody's camping down there. Oh, they're down there fishing, I see them. Somewhere right in here. We saw the drive off. So, pretty sure it is a car. It looks old though. I think the engine's even. I'm not gonna hit something. Let me get in here. Kind of. Uh, go forward. Cause that's the hood. Dude, that's been there so long. There's no way that's our Mercedes. You know? Definitely, definitely a car. Definitely not a Mercedes. Oh, you can see the steering wheel right there. Oh my gosh, that's so crazy. That's the trunk. It's a big car. I don't have a light. I would say I would get in, but... 
it looks like the trunk. Definitely the trunk. Looks like it's missing the, the deck lid. What is this thing? It's a two door, it's whatever a it is. Door, I think. That's two door. There's the trees. Make sure I don't hit these things. Okay. And that's not our vehicle. There's no way, right? No, heck no. That thing's been there a long time. Let's see if there's anything other ones in uh, out here. And good job to the viewer. I you know. Found that, dude. That's crazy. So, it was a vehicle. Definitely not the one we were searching for. I am shocked it was a vehicle. You know, a follower messaged me and sent me some screenshots from Google Earth, and it looked kind of like a vehicle from the screenshots, but you know, you gotta kind of take it from a grain of salt <laughs> because it's Google Maps, quality is not great, but we flew the drone as you guys just saw. 100% vehicle. What time would you guess it is? What time would I guess it what is? What kind of car? Oh, kind. Uh, I don't know. I would say an older car, full size. It's two door. Uh, Look big and bulky and square shaped. Yeah. I would say older. I think car. the engine was ripped out and it's a junker or something. I don't know. It looks like it. And you got to remember, technically, this is private property. So yeah. somebody might have just dumped it on there. But it's clearly like an old fishing hole where people come out here yeah. and go fishing. So it's not heavily guarded. No. We just walk right in. So once again, I just think this is so fascinating that we were able to use a viewer's Google Map. Uh, uh, discovery <laughs> that they thought was a car and it was a car you know we didn't dive on it because we really didn't have much time but we flew the drone and you could see it was a car it looked more like a junk car but nonetheless it was still a vehicle and I'd love to go back there and actually dive on it one day but once again this is just another way that y'all watching can help us and we really appreciate all the messages I read everything I don't always reply because there's so much coming in. Uh, it, it gets a little difficult sometimes, but, but this is just another way that you guys can help us what we're doing. You know, search Google Maps in your local area. If there's a pond, it might be clear enough. It might be a good enough picture that you can find a car and we will go and check it out. I just think it's so cool. Technology is only getting better and better over time. Google Maps isn't the clearest picture, but maybe, hey, in five, 10 years, it's gonna be like 4K, amazing. So I just wanted to say thank you for all the support, all the messages, guys. We have so many amazing adventures coming up. We got the tow truck, the wrecked and recovered. We're pulling out vehicles every week, so that's really cool. Go subscribe to that. Go check out Explore the Nugs channel, and we'll see you guys on the next adventure.